Good evening on this Friday night and welcome to Fox 31 News at 10. I'm Doug Reardon. And I'm Tracy Smith. Sad news tonight out of Tifton this evening. An overnight fire claimed the lives of two young siblings. Fox 31's Tosin Fakile spoke with the family members today and brings us details on the heartbreaking story. A Tifton family is mourning the loss of their twin boys after their home caught on fire overnight. 12-year-old twin brothers Jeremiah Walker and Nehemiah Walker were killed in the fire. Officials said the children were pulled out of the burning home to the porch by their mother and sister. Tifton Fire Department was dispatched to the single-family home in the 600 block of Timmins Drive at about 1.40 a.m. As of this moment, the fire is still under investigation. We do know a point of origin, but the cause has not been determined yet. Fire officials said it took about 20 minutes to put out the fire. The mother of the children and her daughter weren't harmed in the fire, but officials say the mother was taken to the hospital and later released. Grieving father Anthony Poole, who wasn't home at the time of the fire, talked to us about the hurt. It's sad, you know, any time you lose children, any time you lose some love was, especially children, it, 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 it's no, it's no, it's self-explaining, there's no explaining it. it how I feel right now. Deep down in my heart, I, I, I am sad. I feel bad. Even through the pain, the father tries to find encouragement. We're going through uh, a situation that a lot of people have already gone through, but we just got to be strong and trust in the Lord. The family is waiting for an autopsy of the children before making burial plans. Officials say the home did not have a working smoke detector. Tosin Fakile, Fox 31 News.